Today, loved ones came together to remember an Indianapolis community activist. Ron G lost his life to gun violence, the very thing he worked so hard to prevent. Our Anna Tracker shows us how the community put on several events today to keep his legacy alive. He said he was going to be here. An emotional speech. And I looked to my left. Antonio Patton gives right here without his close friend. A different way. I was able to talk to Ron yeah. till about That's one that, that morning before he said, Man, well, I'm gonna be there. Barbershop talk. So I'm coming this Saturday. So I was excited. Uh, I didn't know that I would be here and he wouldn't be standing right next to me. It's been two days since anti violence activist Ron G was shot and killed at 38th and Arlington. After hearing the news, Patton thought about canceling Saturday's barbershop talk. He says Ron G's children still wanted this event because their dad would still want the community together. And I could feel the push, like him telling me, keep going, don't stop. So Patton brought together local barbers to cut kids' hair and share Ron G's mission to end gun violence. That mission was shared all over the city Saturday as community members joined at New Directions Church for a balloon release. Come on, come on, come on. His labor and his life has not been in vain, but that all of us see this as a tragedy that we all have to participate in and prevent from happening again. Community activists hope people lead these memorials and fight in Ron G's honor. We're forever going to lift the, the flag that, it, that he dropped up to the highest pinnacle and continue to push forward on behalf of what he did. Friends and family of Ron G have scheduled two balloon releases in honor of him. They'll be Sunday and Monday night. They're at the intersection of 38th and Arlington. In Indianapolis, Anna Chalker, 13 News.